Hello and welcome to Kismet Rising. So I've decided to start doing pick a card readings again, love types, work related ones, life questions all again. So please start submitting your questions and I'm going to be taking all of them and answering them. And I'm also going to continue with the weekly Oracle card guidance and the energy forecasts as uh, before. So today we are asking the question and that is, will I ever see him or her or them again. So this is if you've been missing somebody, if you've been wondering how they are, if you've lost contact with them, or if you've been in love with them and wondering if you're going to kind of come back together, we'll just see them. The question is only, will I see them again? And so we're going to get these answers. We have three options here, option one, option two, option three, and it's either going to be yes, no, or maybe. So let's see what the cards say. Go ahead, make your selection. You can go down to the description box before below where you'll find your timestamp. All right, I'm going to go ahead with it. So let's begin with option number one. So for those of you who've chosen the option number one, the question is, will I ever see him or her or them again? Will I ever see him or her or them again? So we have a couple of cards that have come up here. We have the Emperor and we have the Five of Swords. Okay. So the Five of Swords are reversed and there's the Emperor. I feel that I'd like to choose another card here. Just for some clarity. And we have the two of pentacles. So I think that this is a very much of a maybe situation where um, this person feels like it feels like there's a lot of stubbornness here in this relationship or this interaction with you two. It feels like there are troubles between you uh, or there were troubles between you, but then it's quite, it's much in the past now and it's probably been forgotten. Uh, however, it's something that has stained the interaction. It feels like somebody's holding onto their guns and not wanting to let go um, or not wanting to, to come back. I do think that this person has uh, given a thought to you over the years or over the time that you've not been in contact um, for some of you, you know, it'll be years, for some of you, months, days, hours, whatever it is, whatever your context is, this person has given you a thought and, um, but it seems like somebody is holding on to their guns right now. Here it feels, it's, it, the, the answer is maybe, it is maybe that you will see this person again, however, it's not really certain. It really depends on their behavior, uh, because even though they've come over their feelings, um, here they are not uh, they come over their feelings of anger or or they they no longer regret it they more like um it's more like they've moved on they don't want to you know avenge themselves um but they are holding on quite tightly to what they believe in and they're quite clear about that and there's a sense here that maybe there will be an interaction. Now, I feel that for some of you, some of you have come here and are asking about this. This is for you, those of you who've lost somebody, somebody who's deceased. And I want to say in that context that, you know, there is a chance that your souls will interact with each other again. There is a chance of that, one could say, and that this person has held you in their being even after they've passed. So um, whatever, however you can understand that, um, so I think here that one need not worry about what happened in the past. One can actually move on from this and think about the, um, the future. In this situation, if you were interested in contacting them and, um, and getting back in touch, you are welcome to go ahead and do that. Uh, they may seem a bit offish or, um, uh, 
not as welcoming at first but I think thereafter it will warm up and they, it will be quite a welcoming and a, a good a good experience with each other so go ahead and and give them a call if you are thinking about getting in touch with this person uh, or if you would like to see them again so uh, the answer to your question will I ever see them again is um, there is a maybe there is a chance that you will see them again So for those of you who've chosen the second option here, the question we're asking is, will I ever see him or her or them again? Will I ever see him or her or them again? Just want to make sure that these are in frame. So what I see here is that there's a situation where there's definitely been a moving on of things. There's a situation where um, somebody is pretending not to be interested, even though they may still be watching you or interested in you. Here, it feels like the road that you need to go on is a long path if you were to see each other again. However, it is, there is a possibility of it. Here, this person's watching you. It feels like they're watching over you or they are definitely thinking about you and what you could be doing. They also see that perhaps you are the one who's walked away from this and um, that they are made perhaps waiting for you to come back in contact with them. And here... There's a sense that, um, that you see, I want to say there's a yes with this card, that yes, you will meet again. But I feel like it's it's condition, there are conditions. Um, so you're probably going to um, find that it, it requires some effort for you to see each other again. So it won't be that you would just bump into each other. Or it won't be that you would just meet each other on the street or something like this. It requires a bit of effort. It requires overcoming some emotional chagrin that you've experienced. It requires making an effort. It requires understanding there's an end of a cycle. And then it requires making an actual effort to make it happen. And if you don't do all these things, then it's likely not to happen for a very long period of time. So I want to say that the answer is yes, but it requires work, all right? Um, for those of you who are asking about, you know, uh, a deceased person, like, will I ever meet this person again in another lifetime or in some other way? I want to say that the path here has been, you have journeyed together, you have been together, and there are possibilities to actually be uh, entwined with each other in the future uh, energetically, but it's more that it, it's more from a distance. It's more from like watching each other, thinking of each other as opposed to actually seeing each other. All right. So I hope that message has been helpful and I've answered your question. I'm moving on to the next one. So for those of you who've chosen the option number three, we're asking, will I ever see him or her again? Or them again. Will I ever see him or her or them again? There's a card here wants to come out. Yeah. 
So with these cards here, I think there's a strong possibility that you won't see each other. It feels like there's a lot of work to be done here. Um, a lot of time thinking about oneself as opposed to another situation. It feels like one's very involved in oneself, whether it's in regard to you or the other person, and that there's a very slight chance that you would see each other. This person's just concentrated on, on what they want, on their goals, on where they're headed to, on what they desire. And they have relegated you to a space of fantasy. So it feels like they are not even ready to see you. Um, it feels more like they they desire you or they think about you in a particular way. So this could, you know, be in a love relationship, but it could also be that they've They've decided what you are to them and they're going to let it be and they don't have any intention of meeting with you again. Uh, and it doesn't feel here that the universe is, or the energy is opening a pathway for you to meet with each other again. So I feel like this, this is like it feels quite final to me here that um, and, and even though there may be some things bubbling under the surface, like there might be some drive to move something forward it doesn't feel like there there actually can be that that things can move ahead and things can go forward um this i want to say you know try another reading a few months down the line or a year from now and and ask this question again because this could be the energy that's just you know it's it's just a, a snapshot of what's going on right now and it could change as we go along so uh definitely look at this again and see but for right now the answer is is no i hope that this reading has been helpful for those of you asking these questions for so long and i wish you all very well as you go along many many blessings to you all blessings abound from kismet rising <laughs>